Australian man has died after he was attacked by a kangaroo that he had been keeping as a pet. A relative found the person. He is 77 years old and he was with a lot of injuries. It was on Monday at his home in Redmond. It is about 400 kilometers or 250 miles south of Perth. When paramedics reached the rural property, the kangaroo even prevented them from treating the man. Can you imagine that the kangaroo even I mean, seriously injured the person and the person was his actually owner. Police were forced to shoot the Marsuel dead. The man died at the scene. A spokesperson, a police spokesperson told media that they believed the man had been attacked by the kangaroo and it is a wild animal. It may have happened earlier in the day. Australia is home to about 50 million kangaroos but the attacks are very rare. This is the first fatal one before in Australia since 1936. The ambulance crew raced to the scene but the man already died there. The police spokesman said at the property there was a kangaroo that was preventing the ambulance crew from assessing the injured man. Police said they had to shoot and kill the animal as it was posing an ongoing threat to emergency responders. The kangaroo was believed to be a wild animal. The man kept it as a pet. Though the kangaroo species was not unidentified, the great southern region of Western Australia is the home to the western grey. The male western grey can go up to 2.2 meters long. They may even weigh up to 70 kilograms. Australian media said the last reported fatal attack by a kangaroo was believed to be in 19. 36. In that incident, the Sydney Morning Herald reported that a 38-year-old man, his name was William Cook, a Cook Shank, William Cook Shank, had he had died in hospital in New South Wales. It was months after he was attacked as he tried to rescue the two dogs from a large kangaroo. The attack left him with a broken jaw and extensive head injuries. This news from AP and BBC. Please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.